Alright everybody, this is Sasser the Gamer here. Welcome back to another episode of Pokemon Red Random. This is episode 4. I believe it's episode 4. Um, we're done in Pewter City. We beat the first gym, uh, Brock in the first gym, and now... Um, are we healed up? I believe we have. Yes. Um, we're gonna head out to, I believe, uh, Route 3 and 4, if I'm counting correctly. Um, uh, Raichu leveled up during that, uh, battle with Brock. We breezed through the first gym pretty easily. Um, excuse me, I'm, I'm feeling under the weather today. Uh, we breezed through the gym pretty easily, so, um, I'm pretty confident, um, our Pokemon's levels are in pretty good shape moving forward. I've got to buy a few potions. Um, yeah, sure. Um, we do have, uh... A team of Raichu, Kingler, Cubone, and right now Temp uh, Pokemon Doduo. Um, he's really in there to help us with catching other Pokemon, hopefully um, some lower level guys later in the game, since our other three guys are a bit higher level. So let's head out. This is, I believe, what's the sign say? Where are we going here? Oh, notice. Thieves have been stealing Pokemon fossils at Mount Moon. Please call Peter Police with any info. I have not seen a single police officer since I entered the town. Where are they? Apparently all on Mount Moon. Um, I believe this is Route 3. Hello, girl. You looked at me, didn't you? Yes. This is a lass. And uh, let's see what she got here. In arena. Level 9, I'll play. Come on. Got me a break. Should be a piece of cake. I don't think we're gonna have any trouble. A bunch of trainers here are good for experience, but I don't think we're gonna have any trouble beating any of these, any of these guys. Uh, um, I don't think there's anything higher probably than level 15 or so. Kingler's now level 14. And we have a Dodrio. This is all Raichu. Seen a bunch of Dodrios, a uh, couple in the wild. This is the first trainer one we've seen in this game. Um, we are going to do some Pokemon hunting once we get cleared this route of uh, trainers, see what's available on Route 3 or 4. Last is, you're mean! Oh, well, stop fighting me! Don't bother. There's a bug catcher. Oh, lovely. My favorite. Hey, I met you in Viridian Forest! I can't tell any of these guys apart. Is it just the same guy that keeps popping up again and again and again, or is there multiple lug catchers? That's the thing you don't get with this Generation 1 game, because nobody actually has uh, legitimate names. And then Arino! Hey, ho! Oh, they should go date the uh, girl we just fought against. Um, yeah, so these are, I mean, these aren't going to be easy fights. But, I mean, I don't expect us to have any problems fighting any of these uh, trainers um, coming up. Easy does it. Haunter, oof. Ugh. Um, our best bet is probably Raichu. Um, if we had a Psychic Pokemon, this would be a different story, but um, we can't use anything with a physical attack, so we'll go with... Uh, Thundershock. We don't have anything that can really take this out in one hit. Ooh, boy. Hopefully that doesn't do too much. This is our first encounter with a ghost. Ooh. I'm not a bad Pokemon man, for a low level on her. Alright, she was now level 15. Wonderful. Bug Catcher there using Machop. Um, I'll stay with Raichu. He's kind of been our go-to guy early on here. <laughs> Bug, Bug Catcher is getting a... He's, he's a... Getting a... Getting some variety into his lineup with the Horner and the Machop. <laughs> you beat me again! No kidding. You needed some better Pokemon, dude. And this is probably another Bug Catcher. I meant to switch out our starters. Hey, I like shorts. They're comfy and easy to wear. Oh, that's weird. That's a. Uh... Oh my. Uh, I don't know. Ah, oh, this isn't a bug catcher. This is a a kid, like me. Oh boy, Chansey. This guy is a wall. Um, no matter what level you face off against him in. 
We're gonna go with Bubble. I believe Chansey is really good uh, physical. Oh boy. Um, maybe I'm wrong. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. We'll try to play script. That didn't do nothing. There we go. I was. He actually has high special. I'm sorry, Chansey has high special. Um, not a good physical defense. I had it. I had it reversed. <laughs> Bubble did like two damage. Yeah, there's Chansey. That was tough. Kingler is now level 15. Gotta get some Cuba and some action. He's starting to fall behind. Um, not here though. He's sending a seal out, so we'll go with Raichu. Um, yeah, Chansey is one of those Pokemon that can do damage. Um, or it can be a tough... I should say a tough fight. He can do damage if you have him on your team. I used him before. And if you feed him some TMs, he can be a very powerful Pokemon. Uh, that's that. <sighs> I don't believe it! I don't know, I'm surprised. Uh, yeah, that's nice. We're gonna send Cubone out there. He needs to get to leveled up a little bit. And who is this? Another bug catcher? Are you a trainer? Let's fight. No, I'm just passing by. <laughs> How do people like normal citizens who don't use Pokemon get around the Pokemon world? That's a great question. Bug catcher again. And Spira, which sucks. Because we can't use Cubone. Uh, back to Raichu again. <sighs> this thing's probably his peck. Yeah. Didn't do anything. Um. Ouch. That's gonna be a one hitter. Yeah, I mean, do people in the normal Pokemon would have to have a Pokemon just to protect themselves when they go out from like city to city, or do they just never leave their homes? <laughs> Tangela. Now this is where uh, I've been saying we kind of need. We'll use Cubone and see if this works. Um, we really could use a fire Pokemon for something like this. Um, let's see if this works. Nope. <laughs> and that was a critical. Oh boy. Tangle is not very powerful. He's more annoying than anything else. Alright, we're gonna switch out to cancel out that bind. Uh, we'll, I guess we're gonna have to use Raichu. <laughs> So much for getting Cubans in action. This is why we need a fire Pokemon. We don't have anything that's very good at taking this. Uh, yeah, I thought it would cancel out the bind if... Oh my god, come on! This is the same thing as friggin' rap. Oh, are you serious? Oh, come on. I don't think this is gonna be... No. So we don't have anything that can really take this. We're gonna just use it again. Uh, Tangela, thankfully, has, like, no real attacks, so he's not gonna... Oh, come on. Bind's probably the closest thing to it. This is a really, really uh, annoying uh, fight. Anyway, that is a prime example of why we need a fire Pokemon. <laughs> and he's bringing out Cloyster. All right, we'll stick with Raichu. He should be able to run hit this, so Cloyster may have a high special, I don't know. Yep, one hit. He's now level 16. And a Ninetales. This is has uh, our guy, Kingler, all over it and all over it. <laughs> that was a very good impression. Ninetales is awesome. I would love to catch it, put add it to the team if we can come across one soon. I don't think Bubble's going to want to hit it. We really need him. Um, once we get to the Water Gym, um, we're gonna give King or Bubble Beam. Um, and that should honestly. Oh come on, really? <sighs> we're gonna have to go back to the Pokemon Center. Unfortunately, I don't have Burn Heal. Um, and right now we're really. This has been a little bit tougher than I thought it would be, honestly. Oh god. Um, with the high evolution Pokemon, with um, some of these Pokemon like Nine Tails, unfortunately. Yeah, we'll just use Bubble. Um, they do have decent stats. That's a one issue. So even though we're beating, we're, we're Kingler six levels ahead in Nine Tails. Honestly, Nine Tails is a much better Pokemon. Kingler gets a level up, and we're gonna have to go back, unfortunately, and heal up. Apparently, if he had new Pokemon, he would have won. He could have, if he was a little bit smarter, probably won that battle. But you know, these guys can't be too smart. Otherwise, it'd be impossible to get through this game. Alright, so let's just heal up real quick and then we'll head back out.
Um, thankfully, we're not too far away from the Pokemon Center. It's not a great sign I have to heal up after four fights. We're not as far leveled up as I thought we were. Um, I probably would have continued on if, if uh, uh, well, Kingler didn't get burned there, but, you know, it is what it is. We really could have used Entangled really gave us a fit just because we, we don't have anything that can really take it at the moment. Alright, so we're heading back out. We gotta head uh, north and around. Uh, this is the last guy we fought, so now we're taking on this girl here. That look you gave me, it's so intriguing. Oh my. Maybe we can go, we, we can go out for dinner after the. Uh, after the, uh, after we're done with this. Here we go again with another grass, Bulbasaur. Let's try. Okay, so Kubon can take, okay. For some reason I didn't think ground was strong against grass, but I'm mistaken. So Kubon, we'll just use Kubon for the time being. I still want to fire Pokemon, but um, I'd rather use Kubon. Oh, and he, she has Gloom. Um, Kubon should be able to take this as well. Oh, Gloom is so weird looking. Ugh, I missed. Oh, and that's the problem. That is why I want a fire bug on, because, hey, Cubone's attacks are strong against Gloom, but that's, that did some damage. And it's going to be an issue, because he's going to use Absorb again, and he's going to make up some of that damage that we got from him. Oh, boy. Let's see? Um, I can't believe I have to do this. I'm going to use a potion. Oh, my God, and he poisoned me. For Christ's sake! All right, we'll we'll heal that once we're done this fight. I don't want to waste a turn with an antidote. Let me use absorbing. And this is a god damn it! All right, come on! There we go. All right, that was important. So now we can uh, probably give Cubo. Yeah, we set a potion on Cubo. And this is. Uh, Probably should have. Maybe I should have done more grinding. I don't know. All right, we'll give him. We'll just. Where is it? Whoop. All right, there we go. Maybe do more grinding. I don't know. Um, we'll fight this guy. You can fight my new Pokemon. Are you that same bug catcher that we fought five minutes ago? Might be. He's like, I need new Pokemon. Now he has new Pokemon apparently, and teleportation powers. Nidorino. All right, this will be a piece of cake. Oh, he's faster. Look at that. And I almost one hit him. That's not going to do anything, dude. Alright. And he's going to bring out Paris. We'll stick with Cubone. This thing probably won't do a whole lot of anything to me. Well, it's apparently not effective against bugs. Never mind. Let's go to Gekta Kingler. Should be able to vice grip him without an issue. <laughs> mm -hmm. Yeah, that did a lot of damage. Scratch is not do anything. <laughs> and that was easy. Alright, well, not too bad. He actually had a bug that time, if you count Barrett Paris as a bug. Ton light inner? What? People say weird things in this game, I swear. Um, we didn't fight this guy. I guess we'll come back. Hey, you're not wearing shorts! For Christ's sake, what is with you bug catchers and your obsession with shorts? And why, if you're a bug catcher, why would you wear shorts? Oh, you... uh, wait, I forgot, they're not bug catchers. They're... Kids are obsessed with shorts. Oh, he has a bug, interestingly enough. He's a Weedle. Uh, we're gonna go to Kingler. <laughs> level 14. It's always funny when you see the level 14 Weedles. <laughs> Just because, you know, we can't do a hell of a lot. Oh, God. More accuracy drops, right? No, nah, speed. And he's st I'm still faster than it. Christ. Yeah. Almost one hit it. And now he's probably going to beat me to the punch this time. Oh, he's a bubble. Don't, don't, don't poison me, please. Oh, come on! Why? Why? Thankfully, uh, didn't really affect anything. Cuban's level 15. Um, 
Freaking poison. Lost, lost, lost! Yes, you did. Alright, now we gotta use another antidote. Damn. Alright, so now we're gonna loop back around. I think there's a couple more trainers, but for the most part, we're done with this route. And there's somebody right here. Yep. Uh oh. Eek! Did you touch me? No. <laughs> Did you touch me? You're standing in the tall grass. It's probably his Pokemon, dummy. Oh, it's a lass. Hello. Oddish. Cubone should take this without too much of an issue, hopefully. Oh, come on. Oh, boy. This is the issue. I believe Absorb, and the reason I might be getting damage from it, it may be a bug move. Not a grass. Alright. Hopefully this is not a critical. Oh, boy. Um... I don't know why I'm doing this. This doesn't make any sense. Shit. I don't know why I had Raichu come out when his lightning attack's not gonna do anything against this Oddish. Yeah, that was dumb. And we're just gonna be literally going back and forth here. Alright. That was so stupid. Uh, you can tell that I'm not the most wise uh, Pokemon trainer in the world here. Oh! Forgot about that. <laughs> uh, vice grip. We are coming up on a Pokemon Center before Mount Moon, so I'm not worried about uh, going back to heal anymore. And everybody got in action on that. <laughs> That's it? Yes, you only have one Pokemon, dummy. Alright, I don't think... Well... Be careful. Nah, that guy's... Not trainer. Woo! I better take a rest. Groan. That tunnel from Cerulean takes a lot out of you. Huh. Well, that's. I'm looking forward to that. Um, I feel like there's another trainer here. We gotta be careful. Maybe not. I lied. That's not a trainer. Ouch! I tripped over a rocky Pokemon. Geodude. It's probably no Geodudes around here, but we'll see. Well, let's heal up real quick. Hell <laughs> yeah. Um, we're gonna go Pokemon hunting now. Uh, we got about I don't know, 12 minutes or so left in this episode. Um, I would like to find something uh, that can be added to our team. No idea what's over here, as, as usual. Let's take a look. Omastar. I was talking about Omastar uh, last episode, I believe. Uh, that's not exactly what I'm looking for, and Cubone cannot take that. We're also using this to get some as an experience opportunity. Um, may need to increase them by a couple levels. Ooh! Now this is something interesting, a Nitto King. Um, hmm. We're gonna pass. Uh, I'm gonna stick with Cubone. As much as a Nitto King would probably make the game easier, I think Playing one through with Cubone would be more fun. Here we go! Rapid Dash again. So we found these earlier. These are much higher level than in uh, Route 22 or whatever. So we're going to try and get this. Um, I'm just trying to think of what I should use. Hopefully, let's try. Bone Club. Uh-oh. Damn it. Super effective. Alright. Let's... Oh, we're trying to... Alright, if we come across that again, we'll just switch out to, uh, probably Raichu is the only one that's probably not gonna kill it. Um, um I don't know if Doduo is gonna be much help. These Pokemon are a higher level than what we caught Doduo at. Another Cloyster? What? Huh. Really low level Cloyster. You can probably take it out anyway. Yeah. Um, let's try and find that Rapidash again. I believe this is Route 4. Right? Route 3. No, it's, this is all Route 3. I lied. I have no idea what these route numbers are in this game. Uh, Rattata, that's, uh... Oh, so exciting. A thrilling Pokemon. This thing we could probably catch, like, without any problem if we wanted to add it to our collection. 
Um, only thing is, it's gonna add it to our team, and I really don't wanna be dragging my team down with one of the Radidas, and another Nitto King. This thing would be difficult to catch. I really think, um, as far as catching Pokemon, we need to come back later to, um, when we have, you know, Ultra Balls <laughs> to catch some of these guys. Um, just because it's just not worth the time and aggravation to, to try and catch some of these things with Pokeballs, it's really annoying. Let's try and find that Rapidash again. I hope I don't have the same freaking trouble with this thing as I did some other Nido King. Uh, go away! I know I can't take this with Bone Club, hence what, that's why I'm running from these uh, fights with the Nido King. Another Beedrill. Um, no, we're gonna run from this too. Cubone's not gonna do a whole lot with that. Uh, we haven't a lot of doubling up of Pokemon early on in this game, which is rare for, um, we've seen Beedrill a couple times, Rapidash a couple times. Alright, a lot of Nido Kings over here. Right, come on, Rapidash, Rapidash! Hitmonlee? Oh, we can fight. We can take this. It's probably a good experience, too, because it's a hit on Lee. Oh, look at that. 139 here. Come on. Freaking Rapidash, where is it? Oh, go. Oh, come on. Alright. Enough with this stupid rat. The beauty of the randomizer, you don't have to deal with rats with this the entire freaking game. Cubans leveled up. Hasn't lost an ounce of health since I wandered into this tall grass. More Beedrill. Another <sighs> Nidoking. King. Oh, come on, where the hell is Rapidash? Driving me crazy. Uh, uh, Kabutops? What about rare Pokemon? I don't know if I can take this with... Well, we'll try. Can't hurt. Yeah, it's... Well, apparently it's super effective. Uh, I don't think Rabidash is going to be easy to find. We can't squander... There's another Omastar. Another opportunity if it comes up. I should have taken that. I should have tried to take that thing out. Um, oh yeah, you can see what I was saying about the fossils. You know, it, it, it's funny in the regular game, the fossils, uh, Pokemon, uh, the Kabutops, the Stars, Aerodactyls are you know these prehistoric rare Pokemon you can only get by fossil in this game. It's just like nah, they came back from extinction apparently. Um, I'm running around in tall grass, or you know sometimes you know they may be somewhere else. Alright, I'm getting very frustrated now. I mean, it's great that I'm uh, getting Cuba and lots of experience here, but I mean, I just want to catch a friggin' Rapidash. Um, Rapidash is going to be tough to level up as well. Uh, well, it may not be. Actually, it'll probably level up pretty quickly, but um, as far as grinding... Oh, come on. I am getting so sick of this. If I didn't have to grind up my Pokemon a little, a tiny bit from Yump Moon, I wouldn't even be bothering. Um, if I switch out to the, what do you call it, oh, um, Kangler, he'll, he'll be able to take Nido King probably without too much difficulty. Oh, ouch! Actually got damaged! Damn it. I really, we cannot squander, we run into Rapidash again, we can't squander the opportunity. That's a Beedrill. Super effective as well. 
Come on, Rapidash, Rapidash, Rapidash. Mr. Mime? Well, we do need a Psychic. I've used Mr. Mime before, and he's not my style of play. Um, he's kind of a defensive wall type, and I am not a defensive type of player. So I'm going to pass on him, actually. Um, I know it's people are probably thinking, you know, Mr. Mime's pretty good, but he's tough to catch, which I don't know, I don't think I'll have a problem catching him. It's just that he's... Oh, God. Oh, come on. And Mr. Mime's probably got an fin infinite defense now. Uh-oh. He's got confusion. You know, he wouldn't be the... Now I'm thinking about catching him. Um... Ugh. The thing with Mr. Mime, though... I don't know. I'd much rather have something in the Kadabra Alakazam family, or a Hypno, or a something else. You're going down. I know, I, that would have been a fit for my team, but I don't like Mr. Mime. I, he just doesn't, as I said, he doesn't fit my style of play. So I'm not going to use him. I could have still caught him just for the, to collect him, but um, Cuban's running out of bone clubs here. We're probably gonna have to go back to the Pokemon Center, unfortunately, or just switch out to uh, one of the other guys who have to get leveled up and who can use experience as well. Oh, for crying out loud! Go away, Nido King. Nobody likes you. Well, that's not true, but. I really want to try and find that Rapid Dash again. Oof. Yeah, Nino King is going to be tough. No, I was one of the one hit. I didn't think I was going to be able to one to hit it. Cuban's up to level 17. That's nice. We're going to switch to Kingler. Um, I really want to find that Rapid Dash again. So we're going to try. We have a few minutes left. Oh, dun dun Kibutops. Oh, I forgot. Freaking rock type. And we still wanted them. <laughs> oh well. No. That's the uh, breaks there. Um, yeah, Kingler is not going to be able to take him or Omastar. I think they are both for rock and water. not having any luck with this whole Rapid Dash hunting thing here. The good news is I, I'm pretty sure, unlike Arcanine, uh, if you guys watched one of the previous episodes, um, he does not have Roar. Thank God. I don't want to have to deal, deal with one of those things again. Oh God, that was so frustrating. Um, this is not working out to our advantage right here. Um, now I'm kind of kicking myself. Maybe I should have just caught Mr. Mine to have a fourth player on the team. <sighs> this is frustrating. So, we did see a Rapidash once. It has not reappeared. Kingler's leveled up. Yeah, let's switch to Raichu really quick. Well, we'll do a couple more before ending this episode. Hopefully we have some luck. I really don't want to uh, leave the tall grass without um, seeing one of these rapid dash again, but we got another Nitto King. Uh, I don't think this is going to be effective. Yeah, he's a ground pipe. Oh, come on, the poison sting. Oh, come on! <laughs> another poison! Oh, I can't, I can't deal with this. I'm already out of the antidotes. Poison sting, it's Poison, uh, the chances that the Pokemon will be poisoned has got to be fairly high. I swear, every time I get hit with Poison Sting, the Pokemon ends up poisoned. Uh, this will be uh, a good one to get experience for. Alright, we'll do one more after this to try and find Rapidash. I'm very upset that this is not going as planned after we saw him that once and accidentally killed it. Uh, 
And a Kabut Top Stamp. Alright. I'll just kill this thing and uh, end it. We're probably gonna start the next episode, continuing to grind up and trying to catch that rapid dash. Eventually, I'm just gonna move on though. I mean, at this point, our Pokemon are pretty. I think almost all that 17. Um, so they're gonna be in good shape for Mount Moon, I believe. But we'll get a lot of experience in there as well. Um, and there may be some Pokemon we can catch in there. All right. Thank you for thank you for uh, joining me for this episode, and I'll see you next time.